All right, YouTube, I'm back. Uh, we're gonna try out my fix. See if that did did it the job or if it didn't do the job. Now, um, when I since I got this thing, I've been smelling a little fuel here and there, and um, I had to take that gas tank off in the process of uh, getting that carburetor and making sure the guy put the carburetor on right because I didn't put that carburetor on. Um, that's the old carburetor, and um, that came installed. You know, I wanted to make sure it was right. Okay, so I took the gas tank off and looked at everything over and it looks all right so what we got here is failure to uh, inspect the fuel line so that all right so I put a new piece of fuel line on there brand new quarter inch and um, so I'm not gonna install all the cage on this inverter it's quite an elaborate setup I'm gonna zip tie it in place so it doesn't shake around and we're gonna go ahead and test her out now it's gonna be a little loud uh, because we're in the back of this Jeep this uh, Jeep and uh, on the other side we got a, a wall so I'm in like the walkway so it's gonna be a little loud but I'll get back to you when I get it all set up Hang on. All right, folks, I think I got her secure. I just zippied it in there so that we could try it out. Because um, why bolt that whole cage together? In front here, there's a whole cage of, of bracketry that you gotta bolt that. But I didn't wanna go through all that if it's not gonna work, so let's find out. All right. Finish hooking the wiring up. Get it all plugged. I like the way they got plug-ins where you don't have to cut nothing. Alright, so engine switch on. Let's tighten that down just a little bit. Alright. Uh, smart throttle off. Make sure the fuel is on. All right. All right. Like I said, it's going to be a little loud on the loud end because, you know, we're blocked in between a space. But let's see if it works. And I got me a heat gun here. And this heat gun is a Wagner, of course. Uh, why buy anything else, really? All right, I'm sure I'm going to hear about that one, right? Thousand watts, I do believe, believe it is. So this is a thousand watt heat gun. Let me see. It says, "Man, it's getting cold out here." All right, ten amps, twelve hundred watt. Right. So here we go. First thing we did. Is old choke er, and we'll pull its tail. See if she's gonna run. Turn the smart throttle on right now. The idle right down. Alright. So let's get our uh, flamethrower out here. Turn it off. Make sure it's off. Plug it in. Okay, here's the big test. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, peak. That actually feels pretty good out here. It's kind of cold and windy. Nice. Now we're going to try 
like shutting it off and see if the throttle comes down. Looks like we fixed it, folks. All right. There's, there's low. There's high. There's low. There's off. did it all right all right folks thanks for watching this problem that we've my birthday present works all i have to do is put it back together we fixed it take care y'all love y'all thumbs up so if you get one of those inverter generators and it has a bad cap that's how i did it bet you could do it too take care love y'all thumbs up bye bye